After 28 days, Pakistan finally opened its airspace for all domestic and international flights. Pakistan's Civil Aviation Authority has announced the complete opening of the airspace, with the national carrier resuming its flights across the country. Flight operations from all airports for international and domestic routes will resume as per schedule, but transit flights will stay suspended as per the national carrier. Now, two-way flights from Lahore to Islamabad and Kar flights from Karachi to Multan departed according to schedule. However, Pakistan still won't operate flights to Bangkok, Kuala Lumpur and New Delhi, citing security reasons. Remember, Pakistan closed its airspace on February 27th following escalating tensions with India. He was down but not daunted. He was captured but not conquered. India's Air Force Wing Commander Abhinandan Vartaman has now joined his brothers in arms back in Srinagar. Head held high, the nation's hero Abhinandan Vartaman entered Indian soil three weeks ago. He's still on a four-week sick leave but has gone back to stay with his squadron in Srinagar, choosing it over his family home in Chennai. The IAF pilot went on leave around 12 days ago after security agencies had completed a nearly two-week-long debriefing on his return from Pakistan. As per standard procedure, the wing commander has undergone a series of medical tests as part of the cooling down process. And now, as soon as his sick leave comes to an end, a medical board will review his fitness to determine whether or not he can return to the fighter cockpit as he wishes to. Remember, Vataman was captured by the Pakistani army in Bhimbar district of Pakistan-occupied Kashmir when he ejected from his jet. He downed a Pakistani F-16 fighter jet before his plane was hit.